Hello, Facebook brethren and sisters. I'm back with another report. It's time for another version of the stupid news. The stupid news. The POTUS, Donald Day Trump, and the Prime Minister Shinzo Abe, you may have seen a video of them feeding the koi. For those of you who are not uh, familiar with koi, they are large carp or goldfish, developed to an exquisite art form over thousands of years of Japanese culture. So they have a very specific and structured ritual for feeding the fish. You ever go and see the koi, for example, at the Chinese buffet? You can go and you can get a little, look, one of those gum things full of fish pellet so that, you know, for example, feed the fish, I don't know, uh, Neko wafers or bubble gum or coins. Never good for koi. And you know, so the Chinese have this tradition too. Um, and so you can buy it just a little thing and you feed it to the, the fish. Okay. Very um, kind of ritual with a little box. So, yeah, of course, um, you know, he, Trump and Abe are emptying, em emptying fish food into the pond. And you can add not knowing, among the other things that, uh, the commander in chief does not know uh, that overfeeding goldfish, even big ones, can kill them. Newsflash, round eye, debu, fat guy, debu, dotard, right? It ain't Wednesday night dinner with a redneck chef. Get a tailor for fuck's sakes, too. God, my God. No fashion sense. None. Yeah, guy looks like he—he he, he looks like he's—he's he's a used truck salesman, right? You know, he dresses with the same, the same flourish. You know, okay. So we're still hoping, also in, in another part of the stupid news, we're still hoping for a speedy recovery from yesterday's report from the man uh, who—and uh, this is a, the marriage of justice and irony. Uh, shot himself in the penis while robbing a hot dog stand in Chicago. I should note that Chicago hot dogs are exquisite. For those of you who have had not had occasion to go to the Windy City or perhaps are not from there, they have an extraordinary marinated tomato slice relish that they put on the hot dogs. It's, oh, it's, it's supreme. So we're hoping for a speedy recovery for that, uh, that that poor guy. And now for a very special And now for a very special stupid news on consumer report. What the fuck is up with Dave and Buster's, really? Do we really need a Chuck E. Cheese for adults? I can't figure this out. Right? This is like fake beaches, you know, in the middle of the plains. I, I, I don't get it. In typical American fashion, they serve a mac and cheese barbecue sandwich. That's, you know, that's probably what we're going to have at the state dinner at the White House coming up soon. And Smurf-colored cocktails. Meanwhile, you can play all the video games, whack-a-mole and skee-ball that you did when you were 5 to 12 years old at Chuck E. Cheese's and get those little tickets, too, right? And I'm